state while Finley and Grove City waited out a four hour lightning delay before the Trojans won at 1:30 in the morning. An option Coldwater and Bishop Hartley explored. Ultimately, it was decided to suspend their state title rematch last night and pick it up this afternoon. Cavaliers leading the Hawks 14 to 7, but Coldwater without quarterback Brody Hoing lost him to a knee injury in the first half. We'll pick this one up with the Cavaliers on top. 26 to 14, seven minutes left in this one. There was a great crowd. Bishop Hartley working a little play action pass. Jake Schmidt, however, for Coldwater, getting in right in there for the stop. Coldwater ball now trying to run some clock. Handed off to Chris Post up the middle. He picks up some nice yardage. Cavaliers are going to stick with the run here, trying to kill some more clock. This is going to be Post again, and he picks up enough yardage to get the first down. Nothing but kill clock in this one really for Coldwater at this point. You see the formation quarterback Jack Hemmelgarn coming in with some nice relief. 9 of 14 for 128 yards and two touchdowns as the Cavaliers make it three in a row against Bishop Hartley. They win 26 to 14.